So, I talked about using um, one of these devices in my truck in another video. So I figured I'd show you what I did with it. Um, hopefully the screen doesn't turn out that way, but anyway. Guess it's gonna flash. But anyway, I got my indicator light here. This is the GPS. It tells me when I've got a lock. Um, when it flashes or on solid, it does not have a lock. Right now it's hard to see, but it's a dim red light. So it has a lock. This is a one, one watt unit. I have a three quarter inch hole mount on the roof and how I'm powering it is up in my headliner here. I have it tied into the same lighting as the overhead lights. Now, the way the lights work in these vehicles, the ground is switched. So when you shut your door, uh, lights will go out because the ground is disconnected. So the positive part of the converter, and it's a three amp converter, positives tied into the lighting. So it's on all the time, except for when the vehicle shut off, uh, this will stay on for I think 10 minutes and that's programmed into the vehicle. It's the same reason why if you leave your dome light on and then you get out of the vehicle with the shut off, you know, for the night, your battery doesn't go dead because it will shut the dome light power off after 10, 15 minutes, minus 10 minutes in this vehicle. So that's how I got it wired in for an antenna. Got a three quarter inch hole mount on the roof and a high gain mobile antenna. I can switch between that one and this Browning. They're both Browning antennas. But yeah, that one still works really good, but the it just doesn't have the same gain. So either way, it's uh they're both high gain antennas, but yeah. And then how I attached it, there's no screws. It's just double sided tape. That is a window mount that I just stuck up there. And it's pretty rock solid. Anyway, figured I'd do a video on how it's mounted. Like I said, that's one watt and I, I can get some pretty good distance. Um, I know I can hear the house at 25 miles and I can communicate back to it. So if you have any questions on how I built this, go ahead and send me a message or leave a comment down below and I will get back with you. But I did do another video on the basics.